top rank. Had a long ass undercard on ESPN Plus. We're not to that yet, but go ahead. <laughs> no, no, no. I not. know. PBC Fox Sports. <laughs> Follow at PBC on Fox. Is a set in the heavyweight division looking like our best prospect over here, Ife Ajagba, with the highlight reel top five Sports Center moment last night with that right. <sighs> That, that, that right hand wasn't fair. <laughs> no. That right hand was not fair. He crumpled him like a piece of paper. Oh, that was oh. just a couple big. Like and then, obviously, Jared Anderson, like you mentioned, probably the best we mentioned before on the show, probably the next American heavyweight champion. Um, very high for him. Yeah. Very oh, high. Fluid. He, he, he does, he's doesn't, he's not stiff like a heavyweight. Yeah. Oh, he, he's, he's got, got great got- personality. Yeah, he's got a little almost James Tony swag in there. You know, he's just confident and relaxed. He's a relaxed fighter and he's fluid in there. Yeah, yeah. that that a jogba right hand though. There, I'm not sure there's a lot of people that that are standing on their feet after getting hit with that thing. Right, yes. that's physics. There, there's just no <laughs> when, you are, when he wow. when he when applied he fought, physics to the yeah, fight. It was, yeah. like, it was Isaac Newton's going down on that one. We had a so he fought on the undercard of of you versus or versus Ugas. And he fought Amir Mansoor, who older veteran guy. And he came out at the way and we're like, okay, you know, he looks like a sturdy guy. And then a jogba came out. And we're like, okay, better you than me. Cause like <laughs> it, did, it just looked like like Mansoor next to a normal like person looks like he would just be a monster. And then a jogba comes out and he's looking down on him on the way. And I was like, okay, yeah, that dude is we had a short era of uh relatively smaller size heavyweights. And I think now we're kind of getting back to the. It's gone. Yeah, it's gone. <laughs> to um, say it's gone. <laughs> yeah, it's gone. And then shout out to it to our guy Sean Zaitel. Pretty much predicted the main event of right. of the top rank card of last Oh yeah, uh, yeah. And just, just missed. real quick to close on the jog, but I was yeah. to see him do that, uh, Carson and Sean, because he when he first came out, what really caught my eyes, other than what Carson said, the fact that he looked like a monster, was uh, he he threw a lot of punches his first 10 fights. Mm-hmm. And then he got into this war on the undercard of Tony Harrison and Jermel Charlo's rematch. Yeah. It, it, he got dropped two, three times. He dropped the other guy two, three yeah. times. Mm-hmm. And, and then his stock dipped a little bit because of that. And then he gets with Kay Karoma and he tries to work on, on boxing and things. And then last night that, that paid off. His, his offense is developing better. Mm-hmm. But um, to, to get the full complete package now, You'd like to see that early intensity when he came from Nigeria to the States mixed in with this new skills he's learning with K Karoma. So he he's back on on his stock going up now for sure after that knockout. So definitely going up. It's yeah. definitely going up. Uh yeah. I think when Big you team. are a heavyweight, when you when you can effectively use both hands and and then on top of that, if you if you are willing to punch a little more than the average heavyweight. Your stock is always going to rise. and You're always going to be a fighter that everybody's looking forward to, especially when you get devastating. That was a devastating knockout. Yeah, you night. put somebody down like that, that your, your stock will rise, I assure you. Right. That that was one uh, that I only watched one time. Like, I, yeah. don't, I don't re-watch them. <laughs> yeah, I can't was, re-watch them. That, that was wicked. Don't tell me you didn't enjoy what you saw because I know you did what you need to do now. Hit that subscribe button, hit the like, hit that notification button. Check us out every week, every Tuesday, something new for you right here on the Port Away Podcast.